It's a six and a half mile stretch of beautiful mountain scenery that winds its way just west of Golden. And as for traffic, this is what you see right now. There is none, or at least that's how it used to be. About a couple months ago, um, we started noticing a lot of increased traffic uh, up here, um, especially on Saturday morning ski traffic. He says when I-70 backs up or is closed, navigation apps like Google Maps are now all of the sudden suggesting Douglas Mountain Drive as a detour. There's hundreds of cars on a Saturday morning coming down this road. And just because you can take this way doesn't mean you should. They don't have a clue about what road they're about to get on. It's unpaved, full of hairpin turns, and steep. You have two 300-foot, 400-foot drop-offs with no guardrails. So if somebody goes off the side of this, this road, uh, it, it's most likely not going to be survivable. They've had too many close calls already. We've had numerous wrecks. Um, I've had my fire truck got hit uh, at one accident. People have been hanging, you know, the, just one wheel off the side of the road or the front of their car. He's now pleading with the apps to stop rerouting traffic onto a road that isn't built for it and reminding drivers if main roads aren't an option, neither is this one. Hopefully save somebody's life, you know. I, I don't want to see, I, I don't want to have to be pulling a family, you know, with kids out of a car at the bottom of this canyon because they tried to save, you know, a half hour to go skiing.